developed on published by CD Projekt in 2020 originally for the Sony PlayStation 4 personal computer on Microsoft Xbox One was that of Cyberpunk 2077. The premise of the original game was that it was set in the future where advanced technologies is pivotal in everyday life. On the main character, V, has to do with the mysterious implant, the game was highly anticipated on early concepts of it showed revolutionary gameplay on details for a modern video gaming experience. But upon release, the game later had one of the worst launches for a title in modern video gaming as there were countless problems with the game. Despite the facts that CD Projekt later spent years fixing the game's problems on repairing its broken trust with consumers for the disappointment that was Cyberpunk 2077, later versions of the fixed game proved to be an exceptional experience, but was never quite the original vision that the game first was. When the game was originally announced, one of the first real characters that people were exposed to from the game's lore was that of Jackito, Jackie Wells. Prior to the official release of the game, Jackie was one of the most promoted on depicted characters from the game's promotional media. On popular consensus were at the time that he'd be a major force within Cyberpunk 2077, along with the main character of V. However, in one of the most infamous plot twists, he was killed off through events in the story very early. Due to the whole promotional aspect of Jackie in his connection with V, on being a stable aspect of V's life in the unstable Night City, made him a fond favorite character, whose early death was all the more controversial with players of Cyberpunk 2077. As discussions had that the Carter interaction he had with V seemed to be simplified and not as deep as it could have been or originally was. Further speculations had that the original story or concept of Cyberpunk 2077 was vastly different from what was later released, as originally CD Projekt desired a game as complex and in-depth as The Witcher 3, and not exactly understandable for casual gamers. Rumors had it that the original structure or premise for Cyberpunk 2077 had the character class that the player could select on go through with events having met Jackie. This would have been the original Act 1. The original Act 2 would have had V along with Jackie, as well as other possible characters, explore Night City, as well as how everyone lives and survives within Night City. Then. With all of the first and second arc details taken into consideration, the original arc 3 would have had Johnny Silverhand introduced as well as the relic which would have been the premise for the end of the game. However, CD Projekt later desired for the game to be simplified for casual gamers in which to encourage them to play through and complete the game. As one of the main problems, casual gamers had that they were complex aspects of The Witcher 3, which had many lose interest in the game due to its complexity and length of time to complete it fully or not finish the game. This desire to please casual gamers combined the fact that Keanu Reeves enjoyed his role as Johnny Silverhorn so much that he asked for Johnny Silverhorn's presence depicted within the game to be doubled, which was later approved by game developers. And essentially the story was remade to accommodate more depictions of Johnny Silverhorn with relation to V, at the sacrifice of other characters. As these decisions were criticized by gamers for quote unquote simplifying the story on um, taking away from what might have been, as the claims were downplayed by CD Projekt but later confirmed upon the details of the disastrous release of the game as well as the inconsistencies with the story in the final version originally released at the time. As others still argue that the entire heist that V and Jackie agreed to do was flawed from the start, but would only end in death for Jackie and nearly V. Night City can destroy the lives of many within it, and for most major and minor characters in the game, that's exactly what happens to various extents. With rumors of the original concept for Cyberpunk 2077, on the fact that Jackie's early death definitely left an impression on players, for better or for worse, it's unlikely the change 
and be forever left as a reminder of what Cyberpunk 2077 was and what could have been. Sometimes a character could be forgotten because a game's development had a minor character be nothing like the original promoted concept.